welcome again to uh, Arthur Brown Photography. Uh, today I'm going to talk about um, hiking poles or walking sticks. Uh, I've got to the age where if I go out in the countryside I sometimes use um, a hiking pole uh, to steady myself. And I uh, uh, bought some ordinary hiking poles from my uh, local outdoor shop. But whilst I've been out using these, uh, the thought did occur to me, well, it's a bit like a monopod. Uh, wouldn't it be great if um, I was able to put a, a camera on the top and use it as a monopod? Uh, after doing some research, there's actually very little on the market that combines um, a decent hiking pole uh, with a, a camera support. Uh, I did find some made by Lecky, but they're uh, very upmarket and uh, around about £100 uh, here in the UK. Right, after doing some serious googling I did um, uh, find an alternative um, from a company called uh, Nedis, that's uh, N-E-D-I-S, uh, based in, uh, in the Netherlands. Um, and I bought this through a company, a, a photo supply company called I have to look, look this up. Imagex, uh, who are in uh, Bicester in, in Oxfordshire. Uh, I have no connection with the manufacturers or the distributors. So I just uh, I bought this, paid full price for it, because I wanted to uh, to give it a try. So this is it. It's a fairly normal uh, shock mounted walking pole. Uh, it's extendable from... Um, <coughs> walking stick height up to normal uh, trekking pole height of about uh, 1.35 metres. Uh, on the top it's got a um, kind of walking stick type handle but also on the front it's got a boss uh, with a quarter inch tripod screw on it. Now this at the moment sticks out the front and when it comes it's got a nice little cap on with a compass in it. You can uh, loosen the collar, put this in an upright position and you can just screw into the bottom of your camera. Uh, and I have uh, used this with my uh, Fuji uh, 100X and also uh, with the, um, uh, the Sony Handycam camcorder. Alright so So if you want to use it as a walking stick, just put the thing down and turn the boss back the other way. It look, it's locked and you've got a good grip on it. It's got foam grip here and then a high grip here as well as the walking stick handle. So it's pretty versatile in terms of uh, support. I decided the other day though, it'd be, good, it'd be quite nice to, I could put the GoPro uh, on here. Make quite a nice uh, monopod or selfie stick for the GoPro. So um, I've got the GoPro uh, and I've fitted uh, a, a tripod boss to the to the bottom of it. Um, just one that you, you, know, you would fit to a, any, any tripod. Uh, the only problem was that I found that when I tightened it up initially the GoPro wasn't at the top. So what I've done is I've put a uh, I actually made a rubber washer uh, so that uh, when it gets to the top it's tight. <laughs> so that keeps that in place then. Now, um, I say this actually does make a very st uh, steady platform for the, for the GoPro. I'm going to cut in some, uh, some footage that I took with this yesterday when we were out uh, and uh, as I said, I'm very pleased with it. I did have the stabilisation switched on in the GoPro, but even so, it's, uh, it's, it makes a, a steady platform. Uh, you know, I keep it on the ground, I can hold it like this and then use the weight of the stick below uh, to give the gimbal effect, or even, you know, use it as a, as a selfie stick, <laughs> if I so require. Uh, so I'm quite pleased with this, versatile. Uh, and it gives me perhaps a bit more safety and security when I'm out 
gives me three points of contact with the ground like a tripod uh, where did we get that one from uh, right I hope you've uh, uh, enjoyed this uh, short review uh, of the of the uh, the Nedis uh, hiking pole monopod uh, and uh, look out for my uh, uh, for my next videos bye for now